Hi, Donna Nichols here. And a week or so ago, Kevin had a reference in his sermon to washing feet. And that got quite a bit of conversation going uh, amongst some of us. And I happened to find a poem about feet washing, and I wanted to share it with you today. It's called God in an Apron. Supper was special that night. There was both a heaviness and a holiness hanging in the air. We couldn't explain the mood. It was sacred, yet sorrowful. Gathered around that table eating that solemn, holy meal seemed to us the most important meal we had ever sat down to eat. We were dwelling in the heart of mystery. Though dark the night, hope felt right, as if something evil was about to be conquered. And then suddenly, the one who loved startled us all. He got up from the table and he put on an apron. Can you imagine how we felt? God in an apron. Tenderness encircled us as he bowed before us. He knelt and said, I choose to wash your feet because I love you. God in an apron, kneeling. I couldn't believe my eyes. I was embarrassed until his eyes met mine. I sensed my value then. He touched my feet. He held them in his strong brown hands and he washed them. I can still feel the water. I can feel the touch of his hands. I can still see the look in his eyes. Then he handed me the towel and said, as I have done, so you must do. Learn to bow, learn to kneel. Let your tenderness encircle everyone you meet. Wash their feet, not because you have to, but because you want to. It seems I've stood 2,000 years holding the towel in my hands. As I have done, so you must do, keeps echoing in my heart. There are so many feet to wash, I keep saying. No, I hear God's voice resounding through the years. There are only my feet. What you do for them, you do for me. Stay safe and I'll see you soon.